Now the software equation which we already had discovered and learned, this is derived from the PNR curve and demonstrate highly non-linear relationship between the time to complete and the human effort applied to the project. So this is a non-linear curve. It has various independent variables involved. The B and B, let me show you here. I showed you this uh, software equation. Now B was the special skill factor, P was the productivity factor, time was in uh, duration, the project duration, E is the effort in person month, or person years. So now the number of delivered line of code, the source statement, L is related to the effort and development time by this equation, we already seen that, L equals P into E raise 1 by 3, T raise 4 by 3. Now L is the lines of code, effort, how they are related, let us see one more. E, as I said, E is the uh, development effort in person month. E, always in per, this is the unit of E. P is the productivity parameter. And then we have, uh, this this P can is, is a, a specific value that reflects a variety of factors that lead to high quality software engineering work. This P may range from 2000 to 12,000, depending on the type of the project you are undertaking. And T, of course, is the Project duration in calendar month. Now let us rearrange it. A certain rearrangement. This effort E will give a very good equation. L raise 3 divided by P raise 3, T raise 4. So let me write it because we are going to use it in an example. So E is the effort spent in person year. Please remember person year. Over the entire life cycle for the software development and the maintenance part also. And T is the development time in years. Please remember that here in this equation, the time will be in years. Now, you, if you have the amount that is say $8,000 is paid per month to a person like this, you can also compute the cost. We have already done this in the previous discussions while we were doing the project estimation. But let me take an example of this particular equation. Just consider a complex real-time software project estimated at line of code as 33,000. The capital L is uh, 33,000. The effort is 12 person month of year. So let me just write it and put these values. I'll, I just want to show what is going on here. Effort is 12 and 33,000 is L and we have to cube it and P is 12,000 you are going to take here and this time I am talking about. Okay, t to the power 4. So now, when you find out the time, there will be some, some time will come. Okay. Now, if I make this 12 as 8, what will be the time? The time will be 1.3 years. That is equivalent to 15.6 month. You just, you can do this uh, mathematics. Now, now, if we extend the end date to 1.75 years, that is T from 1.3, if I'm changing it to 1.75 years, what will happen? This is a highly non-linear nature of the model, what it will give. Now, am I am stretching, I have to use P as 10,000, you can calculate, I'll just, I'm just writing the equation now. The effort will be, L is 33,000, P I'm taking as 10,000 because we have uh, stretched it, change the time. 10,000 and time is 1.75 to the power 4. When you compute it, the effort in person years will come as 3.8. Now that means that if you extend it from 15.6 to uh, 20.1 month, that is extended the end date by 6 months, we can reduce the number of people from 8 to 4. This is what the relationship between people and effort means.